The city in these pages is imaginary. The people, the places, are all fictitious. Only the police routine is based on established investigatory technique. January. The clouds above the jagged skyline are threatening, but it's too warm to snow and yet there is no real warmth. Neither is there a blustering wind or frost-rimmed windows. There is instead a sunless lack of cheer, an overall impression of solemn, monochromatic gray. The gray descends from the curving sky in motion, covers the motionless city buildings, gray themselves with the soot of centuries, extends to the gray concrete pavements and the deeper gray of asphalt streets, becomes a part of the residents themselves, a teeming gray mass that moves along the city streets as though suspended in melancholy, captured in the doldrums of January. This is the first month. It contains 31 days, year in and year out. There will be no future days or years for the man lying against the basement wall. An ax is embedded in his skull. Why do you think the subject of crime and the detection of crime uh, make such potent and often popular themes for fictions? From the uh, writer's viewpoint, he's dealing with life and death and crime and punishment. And, and I can't think of any more important themes that any writer would want to write about. From the viewpoint of the reader and, and trying to understand the popularity of the mystery novel or the thriller, uh, you have in most mysteries a, a, a murder. Uh, some, of, some of them I've written have dealt with arson or um, uh, rape or robbery or whatever, but for the most part it's murder. And when you're dealing with murder, murder is something we are all a bit frightened of, especially in these days, where, and especially in America where crime is, is on the increase, as you know. So we have a, a man or a group of men come in, they solve the crime, they arrest the perpetrator as they would have it, and the reader can go home at the end of the night and pull the covers up under the nose and sleep the sleep of babes, uh, uh, secure in the knowledge that all is right with the world once again. And that, I think, is, is part of the popular appeal of mystery fiction. <laughs> 